Can y'all want some dinner? Little snacks? There you go. There you go. Eat that up. Don't eat the bowl. That's some macaroni and cheese too, man. I know you love that. Whoops. Hey folks, welcome to the new season of the show. We have uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner down here, having a little snack. That's uh, Claudette, Stinky, and Runt. And uh, together they're known as the super group Christmas Dinner. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome to season three of the show. Yeah, yeah. Um, we're going to start off pretty simple this year. We're going to have a nice summer squash soup here. I have some zucchini and some yellow squash from the garden. We got some extra virgin olive oil, some salt, pepper, about a cup or so of Parmesan cheese, 16 ounces of heavy cream, and some vegetable stock. Uh, we're going to grill these squash up first and uh, this will be grilled squash soup. Uh, really yummy stuff. I did forget one ingredient, however, some nutmeg, which I have over here that we'll grind it up later. A uh, little nutmeg in that also is pretty good stuff. Okay, we're gonna start off by cutting up these squash. I have some little zucchini here and some yellow squash. And I'm just gonna split these. I'm gonna put these in this bag when I get them all cut up here. And we're going to season them with the olive oil and some salt and pepper. And then we'll grill them. You could cook these in a pot with the stock. Cook it all together that way. Um, I like the grilled flavor. We grill squash all the time in the summer. Okay, we got all this stuff cut up here. Um, now I'm going to put all this stuff, as much as I can, I guess, into a Ziploc bag. And I'm gonna put some olive oil and seasoning in that. And uh, then we'll put this stuff on the grill. And you know, you can guess at this. It's all good. because it's all going into the blender, so it's gonna be just tiny, tiny particles when it's all done. Liquid. Liquid. Liquid particles. So yeah, this may be the more difficult way to make some squash soup, but it is gonna be good. And just mix all that stuff up in there and get all those squash coated. This is the Char King. It's one of our best priced models. Look at there. Whoa, easy. All right, we're gonna put these squash in this blender here. Now, these are still a little hot from the grill, so look out fingers. Right there, perfect. Okay, so you got those in there. The cream, vegetable stock. Have another cup of that. Parmesan cheese. A little more salt and pepper. We're just gonna grate up a little bit of nutmeg on here. It's really good with the squash flavor. My wife's recipe always uses this, so 
I'm kind of altering her recipe because I couldn't remember it all. Because I probably don't listen very good, do I? <laughs> I'm all ears. Okay. That was probably about an eighth of a teaspoon in my guesstimation. Now I'm going to put this all in the Vitamix and turn it down here and start out on low. all blended up nicely. I'm going to put this in my stock pot over here and just heat it up a little bit. All right, I cooked that in the pot there. I just kind of heated it up to get it warm because the squash were already cooked. And uh, anyway, there you go. There's some grilled squash soup and some crackers to make some cornbread and I probably should have a BLT or something with that too, but uh, that's what we got. Hey, our special guest on the Home Eats segment is Mr. Troy Cartwright. Chipotle. Always Chipotle. I eat Chipotle six days a week. Um, so if given the choice, if we're, if we're really, uh, you know, splurging, we'll go with the pork burrito. But uh, <laughs> otherwise, the chicken burrito bowl, dude, it's the way to go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey, thanks for tuning in, and uh, you can log on anytime at reddirtnation.com and watch this and many other wonderful musical entertaining episode items. <laughs> thanks. Come back again.